mtoto wanangu achisenga from Malawi I'm um, uh, here in Zambia Lusaka doing my uh, training in urology so I'm a uh, 35 years old uh, married with uh, two kids um, my training in uh, urology here in Lusaka has uh, been made uh, possible through the sponsorship uh, that I've had from uh, uh, the uh, Global Urological Project from uh, Canada, University of Toronto, under the leadership of uh, uh, Dr. Uh, Rajiv Singhal. Uh, I must say that I have had a, uh, quite a difficult time to get uh, 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 this far, especially getting the sponsorship. I finished my undergraduate training at become a doctor in uh, 2007 in Malawi and I uh, went and worked uh, in uh, one of the uh, most uh, remote districts uh, in Malawi, Kota Kota. I worked there for about five years. Uh, meanwhile, I had had uh, a dream to pursue uh, a, a specialization in uh, surgery from uh, undergrad. And um, um, it was a bit difficult to find a scholarship to go and, uh, and do the training. I eventually enrolled with a, uh, a regional college called uh, Koseksa, it's College of Researchers of Eastern, Central and uh, Southern uh, Africa, uh, and Malawi is uh, uh, one of the countries. So I started my, my training and started my, uh, 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 my training locally in Malawi. After I done my part one, after two years, I needed to uh, 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 proceed to do my training in urology because it's what I wanted after seeing the burden of urological disease in Malawi. And also to mention that at the moment, actually, uh, Malawi as a country with a population of 18 million does not have a, a, a urologist uh, uh, in the country. There's one Malawi uh, urologist who uh, graduated about two years ago, but uh, he's uh, not in the country. So basically, we don't have a urologist, and I thought that there's a, a huge need uh, for one. So I uh, tried to look for a sponsorship. There were a lot of uh, hurdles that I had, and I must say that uh, a global uh, project in uh, urology uh, through Dr. Singa came to me as an uh, angel at the last minute when uh, I thought uh, I was uh, going to, uh, to, to give up. For some reason, I had that hope that something's going to come up, and I must say that uh, uh, the team uh, in Toronto, uh, uh, through Dr. Singer, tried to do what they could so that uh, I shouldn't miss a year to get to where I am at the moment. I'm hopeful that I finish my training next year. Uh, I hope to head back uh, home uh, in Malawi and uh, serve uh, uh, people there. I hope to settle in Zomba, where uh, the project is trying to uh, come up uh, with the whole uh, program. Uh, my uh, hopes uh, going back there would be that uh, we uh, join the team there working uh, as a Zomba, but also uh, you know to try and improve the uh, services as regards the urological conditions at Zomba, but also I know that it's going to be uh, the whole country at large. Uh, I'm very grateful uh, to the uh, a project uh, for the sponsorship that I'm getting. I'm uh, particularly very uh, grateful to the sponsors who, uh, who actually, uh, you know, are in their pockets uh, to sponsor uh, the project. Otherwise, without which I, I wouldn't have been where I am uh, uh, today.